Good afternoon, it's Gary from BidOnIron.com, coming to you from the Lower Mainland. Today I'm going to show you this 2008 Freightliner Columbia. It has a Detroit Series 60 515 horsepower engine with 1,221,000 kilometers. It has an Eaton Ford 13-speed transmission. The front axle rating is 12,000 pounds and the rear is 40,000 pounds on air ride suspension. It is a 72-inch double sleeper. 11R 22.5 tires all the way around on aluminum rims inside and out. It has a 232 inch wheelbase and twin 150 gallon fuel tanks. I'm going to do a general walk around of the unit and then we're going to come up close for a, an inspection. I have some restrictions on my movements here today so I'm going to do my best to show you as much of the vehicle as I can on the video and of course more detailed photos. It's a purplish red color, quite dark. Hopefully you can see the back of the unit. We've got a lot of uh, sun issues here today. single exhaust. It looks like it's in very good shape from here. So let's come up close and take a better look. And let's come up to the grill. That's in good shape. And let's just go up the passenger side of the unit and we'll follow the bumper and take a look at the driver's side of the unit. Everything looks like it's in good condition. Not seeing any body damage. A little bit of delamination here at the light well. And also, it looks like some of the trim is off here too. Minor repair. We'll show you that front wheel and the tire condition once the hood is up. I'm just gonna take a look at this hood mount mirror. There's no cracks in it or divots. It's in good shape. Let's take a look at mirror on the passenger side here and it also is in good condition as well as the overhead mirror. Appears to be no body damage. And no real scratches in the unit. I am seeing a little bit of paint bubbling here on the side of the sleeper. A look behind the unit here. And the steps up to the aluminum deck are in good shape. There is a bend here. It is bent in the center. The hookups are in order. Let's take a look at the tire condition and we'll go to axle number two. And there's lots of life left in these ones. And I'll just go over the inside tire here and just pan beside the frame here. Come back and take a look here at axle three. The hub cover is missing. And consistent tire wear here. Lots of life left in this one. Let's 
go to the back of the unit. I'm seeing a lot of rust on the frame and the rear end, but I'm not seeing any leaks, which is good. The fifth wheel looks good. Get a look there at the air suspension. And the cross members are all nice and straight. So we are now on the driver's side of the unit. Let's take a look at axle number three. And again, we've got consistent tire wear here. A little less on this inside tire, it seems. Just over axle two, and there's another hub cover missing. And this tire looks like it's new, as well as the inside here. And axle number two on the driver's side. Steps up to the gate on the driver's side are in good shape, nice and level. See one of the 150 gallon fuel tanks there behind the fairing. Let's come up and take a look at the body and the, sleep, the sleeper side on the driver's side of the unit. He's in good condition. No problems with the mirror. Again, we'll show you that front wheel here in a moment when the hood is up. I'm going to take a look inside the cab now. First thing I'm noticing is we do have a lot of damage on the seat here, so it obviously hasn't had a seat cover. We've got manual gauges as opposed to the digital. It is a 2008. I'm just taking a look at the windshield. Both the driver and passenger side look like there are no cracks or chips in them. They're in good shape. This seat has a cover on it. I'm not sure of the condition under there. It is a double sleeper. One of the bunks has been removed. Create some more room. Let's go outside and take a look under the hood. Take a look at the tire on the driver's side. And it's a very good condition.
there you have it. Another good piece of iron from GetAnIron.com. Thanks for watching. And have a great day.